All right, in this video, I'm going to talk about some special kits, case that you want to find dy dx and you need the use of uh, logarithmic differentiation. For example, this type of case here, y equals to x to the power of x. Right, you haven't learned this type of function where you haven't differentiated this type of function where you have a, a function with a power of another function. Right, a function power of another function. Usually, you will have a function right a function power with a number right uh, or a number power to a function but you never have a function power to a function so this type of cases when you have this type of cases where the power is a function and the base is also a function then we need to use the logarithmic differentiation okay that's why i named this as special case so for your extra knowledge so what is mean by logarithmic differentiation is here? Mostly, I, I, I will ask, I will, I will using the technique of putting ln both sides. Uh, I will adding ln both sides. Uh, the logarithmic differentiation here, the logarithmic differentiation that I mean here is I put ln both sides. Uh, ln x to the power of x. Uh, the purpose here is so that I can bring down the x here so that I can differentiate. So it means that ln y will become x ln x by using the law of logarithm i can bring the x down here right uh, so with this i can start using the implicit differentiation right uh, i have forced this thing to become in this form by using ln and i were using implicit differentiation to differentiate differentiate this implicit function here so now uh, so you know that to differentiate ln y you know now I will start differentiating. So differentiate with respect to x. So ln y, I will have 1 over y uh, dy dx, right? Uh, based on it. So 1 over y dy dx. And for this section here, you will have uv, right? Uv. So you write back your x, u, v prime. Differentiate ln x. You will have 1 over x plus with v, u prime. V is your ln x u prime differentiate u uh, differentiate the x here you're getting one right so if i uh, rearrange this i have one over y dy dx to be equals to x multiply one over x you have one plus with ln x right and finally you can get your dy dx your dy dx is y multiply with 1 plus ln x or you can replace the y uh, you know that y is x to the power of x so it will be x to the power of x multiply with 1 plus ln x so this will be your answer for this problem okay for this type of cases then we're using logarithmic differentiation all right uh, one more example for you so you have y equals to a function right a quadratic function power to a quadratic function so as said you're using the logarithmic differentiation here means that i putting ln both side uh, i putting ln both side the purpose of putting ln both side is so that you can bring the x square forward here right uh, then it become a product form between a quadratic and a logarithmic function so now i starting differentiating here for ln y you have 1 over y dy dx I start differentiating so differentiate this one you will have uv right uv so if you worry that you will have careless mistake you can do it separately so u is x square right and your v is ln x square plus width 3x so u prime you will have 2x v prime you have 1 over x square plus 3x right differentiate ln 1 over x square plus 3x so differentiate x square plus 3x 2x plus 3 done so now everything put inside uh, the formula will be u v prime plus v u uh, v u prime u x to the power of 2 v prime uh, your v prime so it will be uh, 2x plus 3 divided by x square plus 3x right x square plus 3x plus bit v v ln x square plus 3x v u prime 
2x. You have complete. So, okay, then you have to move your dy dx. You know, this is 1 over y. As you move the y over there, means that it's like everything. Okay, I just expanding. So, I get 2x cubed, right? 2x cubed plus with 3x squared divided by x squared plus 3x plus with 2x ln x squared plus 3x everything right everything multiply with y right multiply with y so y so your y is actually this one right multiply with y can bring the y everything multiply y right this y bring over here everything multiply with y so what is your y uh, your y is actually initially is x squared plus 3x to the power of x to the power of 2. Uh, that's the way we differentiate this type of function to the power of another function. So that's all for this video.